What's up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Angela and we are planning a wedding. So today's video is going to be what's on our registry. We're about 100 days out from our wedding. So our registry is all done. Um, one thing to note about the registry is really good for anybody who is going to be buying a house pretty soon or just bought a house even though we already live together and have been living together for some time we don't plan to take most of our stuff with us this is just a combination of crap that we both had even previous to our relationships so we figured that the best way to utilize our wedding registry would be to put things on there for the house to help us kind of jumpstart our new journey in our new home so we're super super excited about that so i'm just going to jump right in because there's a lot we have a large wedding and so we wanted to make sure we had enough stuff, enough options on the wedding registry um, in case people wanted to contribute or buy, which we're so appreciative of. So let me go ahead and jump in. So the first thing on our wedding registry is an iron, an adult iron. I don't know about you guys, but many of the irons that I bought in the past are just cheapy and you know just something to have so we went ahead and picked what i call an adult clothing iron so we can have kind of a good quality one so the next thing we put on the registry is a stainless steel chopper ideal for you know cooking and prepping meals the next thing was a garment steamer you know this is an alternative to the iron i do like to steam my clothes especially if i go into the office for work so i thought this would be a good handy thing to have and we got the handheld one because it's lightweight and easy to store the next thing is the stainless steel spoon rest you'll notice that a lot of this stuff is for the kitchen because the kitchen is my sanctuary and it will be probably one of the most heavily concentrated rooms that we have because just given the layout of the new house it will be kind of the center stage of the house the next thing is a juicer um i feel like this is such an adult thing and i think it's so important to have i do want to keep my body right keep my body tight okay so the next item is a calphalon cookware set this is kind of fancy ish i wanted a good cookware set but i also wanted to put something on there that was pretty affordable so i thought this was a good set to have i did inquire with my mother-in-law and she did approve this brand the next thing we put on there are some metal skewers we live in the midwest so barbecuing cooking out is everything especially in the summer so I thought these would be a good thing to have the next item is a wood utensil set um, it's just I love the aesthetic we'll have a lot of kind of bamboo type things in the kitchen one of my favorite things to cook with now is my wooden spoon and I don't have anything else wooden so I thought this would be a nice add to my collection especially because as I mentioned I'm throwing everything else out and starting new the next thing is a Roomba vacuum. You guys, we are gonna have carpet in the bedroom, so we, we definitely need a good vacuum. I thought the Roomba would be good to keep up with kind of spot vacuuming throughout the week. I can just run it and let it go. Uh, the next thing is this glass wine carafe. I'm working on a vision in my head for what our bar section, bar area will be like. So I thought this would be a good addition because I know I will use it. Next is a Bissell carpet cleaner. You guys, again, we're gonna have carpet. So we wanna make sure to keep those carpets clean. Since we will only have carpet in the bedrooms, I figured we don't need like a huge fancy cleaner and I think this will get the job done and it's pretty affordable. Okay, so the next item is the stainless steel trash can. You have to have a nice fancy trash can when you move into a house. Currently we have a black one that we probably picked up from Target or Walmart. Eh -eh, okay, aesthetics will be a thing in this new house. So we needed that stainless steel trash can. The next thing is a hand blender. I currently have a big blender, but you know, sometimes I don't feel like getting that out. So I thought this hand blender would be a nice kind of compact thing to have. The next thing is an iced coffee maker. You guys, I am the iced coffee queen. I love a good iced coffee. So I thought this Mr. Coffee iced coffee maker would be great for me, especially in my mornings. Um, before work, have a nice iced coffee. Can't wait. The next is this chip and dip server. You guys, at this new place, I plan to be the hosting queen. I wanna do all sorts of hostings and parties and host holidays at the new place. And so I thought this chip and dip holder would be great because we plan to have many, many get togethers at our new house. Okay, the next thing, kind of different thing we have is this tetherball set and this is perfect for us. So one, we'll be living on five acres of land so we have the room for it. Two, we have kiddos and so this will be great for the the kiddos to have something to play when their friends and stuff come over and three it's nostalgic okay i used to love tetherball in elementary so i can't wait to get out there and play with the kiddos okay, so next we have an electric slicer slash shredder i can already see myself using this when i'm trying to get some fresh cheese grated and just all sorts of things can't wait Next thing is this heavy duty storage shelf. This will likely go in the garage and this is more of a husband type 
thing, you know, I noticed a lot of times on the registry, the husband does not get a say. So I did try to pick out some things for Tyrone. So he, you know, had a few things on here that would be great for him. So this will be good for, to store all his man stuff in the garage. Next is some garage hooks. This is more Tyrone guy stuff um, for all his man things. Next is this Aesthetic Lemon Lime Squeezer. Fun fact about me, I love limes, I love lemon, and I love squeezing it on anything I possibly can. I just thought this black one was nice, cute, and aesthetic, and so I had to get it. Next thing we got was a deep fryer. So we currently have a fry daddy, um, but I wanted something a little bit bigger, and so I thought this would be a good addition. I do fry foods, and I like this one because it's a three basket one, so I can fry, like say I make, you know, fried shrimp and fries, I can fry them both at the same time. So, so I love this, and even if we don't get it off the registry, I will be purchasing. The next are these classy champagne flutes. You gotta have some nice champagne flutes. I love these. And again, I'm thinking about the vision for our bar drink area. And so I thought these would be a nice addition. Next is this knife set. It's not super, super fancy, but it's better than what we got. The current knife set we got is giving very much Walmart. And in the new house, we need something a little bit better, a little upgrade. So I thought this would be a good addition. Next, we got these juice glasses. I love these. It'll go perfect with my juices from my juicer that I've already showed you guys. It's very much giving me I'm a cool mom. Next is this luxury bath caddy. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so excited about this one because we will have a standalone bath in the master bathroom. So I cannot wait to put this on the bath and just have spa self-care nights in the bathtub. I, I absolutely cannot wait. This is a must and I'm here for it. Next are these glass smoothie straws. These will be perfect for my smoothies that I have, my iced coffee, my juices. These are just a necessity. Next, we got this electric pepper and salt grinder. It's giving very much aesthetic YouTube mom. All the YouTube girlies have it. I thought it would be a great addition to our kitchen. So I love that for us. Okay, next is the Bartesian. If you guys have not heard about the Bartesian, you guys, I want this thing so bad. My sister has one and it's very much giving I'm a bartender. Like, like I said, one of my plans is to host more and I do wanna like be better at making drinks and things like that, try out different drinks. This will be a game changer and will allow me to cheat sometimes and I want this thing so freaking bad, okay? love this thing next we have bamboo glasses for storage you guys our pantry at the new place will be to die for okay so we have to do all the organization all the aesthetics all the things because that is what that pantry is made of so i've been thinking about this a lot and i think my vision for the pantry will be a lot of bamboo glass storage so i put these on there because this will be the look that i'm going for and I actually got these in all different sizes and shapes so i got them like larger ones mid-size ones and also for my seasoning so that's going to be the aesthetic for all things organization is bamboo and glass next we got this glass teapot um it's really just giving all the vibes. I love it. It's cute. Uh, next, we got this media bed tray and phone holder. You guys, I can't even front. We are not above eating snacks in the bed. So I thought this would be great um, for when we do late night TV watching and snack eating in our room. Next is this popcorn machine. Oh my God, we had to get this. The kids will love this. They love movie night. They love popcorn. This will be very much used in our household if we get it. The next thing is the spin mop, you guys. All of the YouTube moms have the spin mop. I need it, I want it, and so I put it on the registry. Next, we have a dust buster. This is gonna be perfect for spot cleaning. My goal is to keep up with a really good cleaning routine um, because like I said, we plan to have people over, we plan to host, so the house needs to be in tip top shape. So I envision using the dust buster as sort of a spot cleaner. Um, and so yeah, I think that'll be a good addition to my cleaning products and gadgets. Next, we have this mop and broom holder. This will go in our laundry room. We actually have a laundry room, so I just wanna have things organized. This will be good to have this organized, so I think this is a good addition. Next, we have a series of cutting boards. I mean, you always need cutting boards, so I thought I'd add a few there. Next is this Mr. and Mrs. dish. This is perfect for us to hold our rings in. Um, my husband actually, I don't know that he takes his off, but I take my ring off 
every day. Um, and I say my husband because we're already married. We did like a little small ceremony and our big wedding is in May. So that's why I say my husband already. Next is this Califon Bakeware set. Again, mother-in-law approved this brand. So I thought it would be good to get. I am definitely trying to be in my Suzy homemaker bag. Um, we also added this blue bakeware set, um, which I really, really like the color and I thought it would be nice to kind of just switch it up a bit and you can never have enough bakeware I feel like. Next we put several Lowe's gift cards on there. As a new homeowner Lowe's will probably be a common occurrence for us because there are DIY projects that we plan to do. Again we do have five acres of land. We have all sorts of backyard projects and gardening projects and things like that that we're going to be getting into. So we thought Lowe's gift cards would be a good idea to add to the registry. Next is an electric griddle. This takes me back to back in the day when I was young, my mom used to cook breakfast on the breakfast on the weekends is pretty important in our household. So I thought this would be a good addition to our kitchen gadgets. Next is the crock pot Dutch oven. So we got this one specifically for several reasons. One, we don't currently have a Dutch oven. We have a French oven, which is basically the same thing, but I wanted one that was round. Two, the pink color is so freaking cute. Three, Dutch ovens slash French ovens are life. You need them. You should always have more than one. And four, we got the Crock-Pot brand because it was just way more affordable than the Le Creuset. Like who is going to buy you a Le Creuset Dutch oven? I mean, maybe people will, but we just thought the Crock-Pot brand was more affordable and still heard good things about it. Next is this pegboard organizer and then this wall mount storage. Again, these are all husband things that will probably be in his garage or workshop or something like that, but he needs things. He has a ton of tools. I haven't mentioned it before. My husband can literally build anything. He is a handyman. He's a general contractor by trade. So he has all the tools, all the things. And so I wanted to make sure he had a place to put all his stuff. Next, we got these mixing bowls. We so needed these. I love that they're different sizes. And um, like I said, I do want to get in my Suzy homemaker bag. So I plan to do a lot more baking. Um, so these will be a good addition. Next, we got these baking mats. Again, Suzy Homemaker. Um, so I think these will be a huge necessity. Next, we got a set of cast iron skillets, you guys. Cast iron skillets are up there with Dutch ovens. They are game changers. You absolutely have to have them. You need to cook with them. We currently only have one. So we thought it would be great to have not only more than one, but also ones of different sizes. Next is this fruit infused pitcher, you guys. This is going to be perfect for our fridge and freezer combo. You guys, I cannot wait to show you the fridge and freezer, but I am so looking forward to all the storage and space we are going to have in this fridge and freezer. And this fridge and freezer will be the most organized and aesthetically pleasing fridge slash freezer that I've ever had. Okay, so I need beautiful pictures such as this one. Okay, because aesthetic okay vibes okay kitchen will be the center of attention in our home next we got a ton of food storage containers again organization aesthetic long-lasting food all very important for the fridge so we made sure to get some of that you know i want all the organization vibes i don't know about you guys but i'm obsessed with the organization videos i love them they are such inspo and i don't know if i get good enough at it maybe i'll do some Next, we got the ring security alarm because uh, security is life. Although we will be on land, we still will be kind of in a um, urban area. So, you know, we need to be protected. We need to make sure we're safe. So I thought it'd be good to get a ring. Next, we got this bread or batter bowl. My sister actually suggested that I get it because it's really good when you fry foods. And even though it's bad, I do fry foods. Okay, so I thought this would be a good addition and why not add it to the registry? It's affordable. So that's one thing I, I, I should mention is we did have a variety of things that were affordable. A lot of the things we got are under $50 and then we have some that are between 50 and 150 and then we have a select few of over 150 gifts. Next, we got this electric spin scrubber for the tile on the floor. You guys, my least favorite thing to clean is the bathroom, but I want my bathroom to be spotless. So I thought this might help with keeping the bathroom clean and just getting it done because you guys, I cannot stand cleaning the bathroom, but it has to be done. Next, we got these taco stands because Taco Tuesday is life and I've always wanted these. I love when you go to the taco shop and they have these and so I want to have Taco Tuesday nights where we have these. Um, especially in the summers with the kiddos. I just think that would be a fun family tradition to have. Next, we got this toolbox. Again, these are husband things. I had to look out for my husband on the wedding registry because let's be honest, 
I spent most of the time putting this together, like most women do. <laughs> Next, we got more glass, carafes, pitchers, and things like that. And I wanna have an aesthetically pleasing refrigerator, so I plan to put all the orange juice or apple juice or you know just non-water things in carafes because vibes because aesthetic okay uh next we got this echo show so i see people with this all the time in their kitchen i thought it'd be great for me when i want to you know read off recipes or watch youtube while i'm cooking like i said the kitchen will be my sanctuary it already is i spend a lot of time in the kitchen um so it'd be nice to be able to just kind of read my recipes on the screen i do use a lot of recipes when i cook as well as, you know, I listen to a lot of YouTube or watch YouTube or anything like that, podcasts while I'm cooking. So I thought this would be a great thing to add to the registry. Uh, next, we got some aesthetic measuring cups. You guys, again, like I said, we're throwing out a lot of these things. I just want things to be a little bit more um, quality and aesthetically pleasing. So I thought these were beautiful. Next, we got a tractor supply gift card because like I said, we'll be living on a farm. So yes, we'll need to go to tractor supply for sure. Next, we got this salad serving bowl. You guys, I just love the aesthetic of this bowl. It goes with the wooden theme that I'm going with. And so I just, I had to get it. I love it. It's so cute. I don't know why, but I need it. Next, we got this pizza stone for the oven. This is another thing that I just thought this would be great for some of the, you know, pizza nights and stuff we have at the house with the kids. Um, I love the idea of us making our own pizza. So I thought this would be a great thing that will be definitely utilized by us at the new place. Next, we got this Lazy Susan. I thought this would be great. We are gonna have this big, great island. So I thought this would be great for the island. I can already see me, some decor ideas in my head. I know I will use this no matter where it goes. So I went ahead and put it on there. Next, this beautiful, aesthetically pleasing rolling pin. Again, I'm trying to get in my Susie homemaker bag and bake more and also it's just cute. It goes with the black measuring cups and things that I've already put on the registry, so. Next, we have this Glad cake storage. Oh, this is great. Again, I want to work on my baking. I want to display the beautiful things that I bake um, when people come over. Hey, you want a piece of cake? You guys, picture this. Just picture with me. This, I, again, um, super cute. Thought it would be a great addition. Next, we got some more measuring cups. These are more of the glass ones. Um, I thought these would be good addition too because currently, we only have one one broke and it's more plastic. I thought the big heavy glass ones would be um, better suited. Next, we got this lovely cookbook holder. Like I said, I do use recipes, whether that be digital or cookbooks. I definitely wanna be that person that displays a few cookbooks in my kitchen. So I can already see me keeping one on there while I'm cooking. I mean, you guys get into the vision, okay? You have to visualize things that you want to happen, what you want things to look like. So when I was going through the registry, I was literally envisioning me in the kitchen using this this cookbook holder next we got the shark vacuum you guys this is a need i put this on the registry but regardless of whether we get it we're going to get it we need a really good vacuum and i've done a lot of research on this shark vacuum and this is the one that we need next is a kitchen aid mixer again need this i am going to be in my baking bag absolutely need to have a kitchen aid and i want this beautiful pink ones. Next is this automatic food sealer. This will be a game changer for me. We'll be able to kind of save food and, and just be a little less wasteful with this thing. We'll see. Next is this Bissell Steam Shot. You guys, I've been wanting this forever and we actually already got it. Some already, someone already bought it for us. If you watched my last vlog, you saw me unbox it. But this is just great for cleaning like little pesky areas and stuff. And you guys, it's taking me everything in me not to go ahead and open it and start using it, but I just wanna wait to bring everything to the new place. Next, we got an electric wine opener because it's necessary. Again, I am still working on the vision for the bar area, but I knew this would be something that we absolutely needed because I do drink wine. Next, we have this kitchen knife sharpener. I thought this would be a good addition to our list of kitchen gadgets because who doesn't love a good sharp knife, especially when they cook all the time like myself. And last but not least is this cool chopper slash scraper. Again, this is putting me into my chef. The kitchen is my sanctuary bag. And so I loved it, I needed it. And it's actually already been purchased. So again, this is one of the things that I'm not using, but really, really want to use. 
all right guys so that is everything that is on our registry i know this was a long video but i hope you guys found it helpful i'll try to link everything below this is a lot of stuff but i will try to go ahead and link everything below for you guys please let me know down below if you guys want to see more in-depth videos about wedding planning and all those things like i said we're 100 days out so things are starting to get real all right i will see you in the next video please hit that like button before you go and subscribe to the channel bye